All right, pups, that's the last of the food we have, but you guys have really saved us a lot so far. I mean, now that we have the ax, I'm really feeling like my spirits are way up and it may not be everything. I'm sure we may be low on resources, but hey, you guys have really gotten us a lot further than I expected to get on this run. I'm really proud of all of you. And Slayer, what do you think? Can we find the way to your heart pretty soon? But all right, guys, hello and welcome back to the Red Lantern, where we're getting ready to jump back on the trail, even though I am still bruised and battered from yet another run-in with a musk ox. Kind of annoying that. And we're going to be rushing along with our newest dog team mix that we've got, Bodega, who has already saved us from weasels stealing our food and more importantly from drowning in a frozen lake that cracked under our feet. We've got Noodle, who hasn't run into his friend just yet, but we'll have to see if he's going to discover a certain wolf lingering in the forest nearby. Iggy, who has saved us from a musk ox just now. Iggy, are you feeling better? Oh, come here, buddy. She's such a good girl. I am so proud of her. That muskox was really trying to take out the whole team, and thankfully she was able to rescue us, even if I am still kind of battered. And then we've also got Slayer and, of course, Chomper. Who's a good dog, Chomper? You're a good boy. So, all right. Um, you know, a little bruised and battered, but spirits are high. Let's do this. Back, back on, the, on trail. the trail. Let's get back out there. All right, pups, are you guys ready? Mush on. We're going to continue with our wild run where we're letting the dogs actually decide where we should go. So far, that has worked out really well for us. Also, there's a very terrifying image of glowing eyes in the dark. It looks like there's something out there. Let's go ahead and check it out. Are oh, jeez. You okay? You don't look okay. Okay. That is actually the absolutely terrifying sight of an elk who is currently shedding his antlers covering. They have that soft velvet that grow on that grows on top of the antlers and actually provides the blood vessels and the blood circulation that they need in order to grow their antlers. And once they're done with the growing part, they shed the velvet and it's a really bloody mess. Quite literally, it looks terrifying. I can't even imagine like how startling that would have been with people seeing it for the first time and not knowing what was going on. But it's just kind of in a weird way, like I guess a butterfly coming out of its cocoon, if you think about the antlers that way. Let's see if we can get a little closer. All right, don't run off. You are a walking food bar. Oh, don't mind me. Still a very creepy walking food bar. Oh, geez. This isn't a zombie thing. Right? I don't want to be undead. I'm gonna go now. No! I wanted- What? I wanted to be able to shoot it! Hey, pups. We were getting closer for the sake of the gun! You I Nimnai! Here. Let's go. Uh, well, at least we managed to see the really creepy antlers. Definitely should have gone ahead and tried to hunt it. Sorry, pups. That's my bad. We're I thought progress. we'd make some sort of really cool discovery if we walked right up to it, but no. We just had to worry about zombies. Look, I don't want to think about zombies. They're one of my top three biggest fears. Right next to escalators and dinosaurs, actually. Look, if she can be afraid of manhole covers, I can be afraid of zombies, escalators, and dinosaurs. It's a given. Oh, do you hear that? Noodle, are you trying to bring it closer or keep it away? How close do you think that wolf is? Uh, should we check it out, Noodle? Oh, it's the hurt wolf! Noodle! Okay, okay. Um... Alright, we're gonna go ahead and we are absolutely going to set it free. I know I've said a few times that I want to try a little bit of every one of the choices, but that is going to have to be our exception. We're never going to choose a choice that's not going to involve trying to set this wolf free. Especially now that we know that it's become part of Noodle's story. Oh, hang in there. thing. I'm glad you brought us out here, Noodle. I hope that wolf makes it. And now that we've done that, every run we go on Thanks with Noodle now, slide, pups. we'll hopefully have that wolf. All right, let's mush on. Ready to protect the, you know, the edges and bring us a little bit of food. 
I think that we're about to end this run right now, unfortunately, but I'm really proud of where the dogs have brought us. We've discovered some new tools. We've learned some new facts. It's been a pretty good attempt at this. Oh, hey, is that, that's the frozen deer, isn't it? That is the frozen deer. Up there? Hi there, what is it team? Uh, okay. You okay, whatever you are. All right, you are look. really still. This, I'm right after here. seeing a, a elk shedding its antlers with its bloody little velvet pieces flying everywhere and having found an axe that's just all by itself in the middle of the forest would absolutely freak me out. But I'm going to once again be extremely glad that the dogs managed to find food for themselves right at the last moment. Um, this is fine. Don't think about zombies. Don't think about mysterious axes just left out. With no owner? What happened to you? How did this happen? It's okay. It's just frozen. Every time the dog like the dogs growl like that, I actually think that it's like the deer sort of growling at us, and it makes my heart just stop every time. At least it's preserved. You need food. Oh, Matt School did not prepare me for this. Okay. Well, that was exhausting and a bit horrible. But we got some extra food. There we go. Let's see if we can camp. Well, that was worth it. All right, pups. We're we about to completely die of lead. hunger. All right. But we can Let's get a on. little bit further if I can just go ahead. Come on, guys. It really, you led me to the food and we would have survived if I had just shot the That's zombie rest. little elk. Oh, I'm so proud of this all of you. This is a good spot to rest. All right. Let's go ahead. Fire would be nice. Okay, just a little birch bark, a little spark, and behold, fire. All right, I'm going I'm to have some to some food. And then we'll feed the pups. This is just barely going to top us off. So I don't think we're going to be able to make it much further, but having the dogs lead us has just been fantastic. Good time. Chow down, pups. And let's see if we can talk to Noodle about having his friend, the, the wolf, around. Ugh, and I can't believe my ribs are still bruised from the muskox. At least once we finish this run, we can imagine that we managed to get back to the cabin, you know, using a little bit of that roleplay to grease the imagination wheels. And uh, then I got some good rest. I really feel like out of everything that we've run into in the wild, I'm less scared of the wolves than I am of the muskox and the squirrels. I mean, that thing could have had rabies. I still haven't forgotten sorry, how it bit buddy, me right I don't on the have nose. Anything to feed you. Wait, what? I thought we had enough. I thought we had more food. Oh, jeez, guys, I'm so sorry. I I wasn't paying attention, and I must have just chowed down on all of the food. Oh, pups, I'm sorry. You guys, you guys deserved better than that. Oh, Get back on the trail. Ready to go? Okay, I'll do my best. Sorry, guys. Mush on. Don't worry, when we, you know, grease the wheels of imagination with a little roleplay and imagine that we managed to get ourselves back to the progress. cabin when we fail this, then we're gonna go ahead and imagine we take them home to the big, beautiful piles of dog food that we just have stacked to the ceilings and waiting for them. And Noodle's taking even more leads on this. Good boy, Noodle. Really sorry about the whole food thing. Wait, I must have fed them. What is that? Hey, okay, so that's a bullet. We have bullets. We're good, team. On by! It'd be a miracle if we could find one more tool, but finding two tools on a run? That would just be ridiculously good luck. Ah, uh, I think it's about to be over. They're gonna be too tired to make it to the next spot, I think. Or... It looks like there's something out there. Or okay, what do we have here? Hey, we needed some more bandages. All right. Well, at least I can patch up my okay? bruised muskox ribs. But this is going to be the end of it, here. isn't it? I tell you what, pups, you guys did such a good job this time. I'm definitely going to go ahead and let you lead us on another wild run. Eventually, we're going to figure out Slayer's secret history somehow. Closer. All right. I mean, look, they really kind of led us in a straight line. I like that Noodle took lead for a lot of the run. And I just don't know. Noodle's handling it's the run again. It's good, pups. Sorry, guys. We're okay. 
We're all okay. There just wasn't any food around. I'll make sure to feed you. Okay, I just have to be prepared. And hope the world is on my side. Alright, let's see how we did this time. I never met a tree I didn't like. There's just so much ice. Fed the pups a feast for dog kings. We didn't get any of the pups pieces this time. Saw the weasel war dance. More cute than scary. And for the deer, how long was that deer out there? For the squirrel, I will learn how to speak squirrel. And the skunk, that spray smell smells like rotten gasoline. And the wolf, I couldn't leave the wolf like that. All right, so are we bringing any more food by chance? Fingers crossed. Bringing more bullets, I'll take that. Come on, food. And no more food. Ha, huh, but at least we have the ax. In an adorable stair shape, no less. So, all right. And that little nightmare reminded me to pack our ax to strip those birch trees. It's a good thing we have an overactive imagination. Look, we, we have the post-it note. Well, we can imagine what we're up against. Hunt huh, chops. <laughs> good boy. All right, let's do this. I wonder if I should take the lead so on this go. one. Let's get out there and live wildly. Live, live wildly. the life that feels true to us. Yes. I love that message. All right. I let the dogs decide last time. And we did pretty good. I think right. I'm going to go uh, ahead and I'm going to let them decide this time too. We've got an axe. So I, uh... But uh, I'm really on. kind of worried. I feel like we just haven't had any luck in figuring out Slayer's story. You know what? We'll do this run, and if, you, you know, we aren't able to figure out Slayer's story this time, we'll try going all ha or all G and see if we bump into Look anything. Look in the road. Or two. But for now, it's all up to you, pups. You guys get to pick where we go. And if any of you have had luck with Slayer's story, could you give me just a hint? Don't spoil it, but give me a hint. Where you think we should go, what you think we should do. She's really the shyest dog. It took forever to be able to win Finn over. Do you think we need to add Finn to the group too? Looks like we've got a chance at a meal, pups. Maybe if we mix Finn in. Finn in Just again. Quiet. Huh? Just huh? be calm. You've got this. Sorry, that was a bit of a strong pun. Oh god, oh. I only injured it. Um, Come on. One more should do the trick, as long as I don't miss. That was like a perfect shot. Don't miss again. Missing isn't an option. You can't leave it injured. You can do this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, there we go. What we need it. I'll collect what I can and get back to the sled. At least we got our food. Well, that was worth it. Some more food. Three bullets left. Let's Good job on there. you guys guiding us over to there. It seems like the dogs at the front really are the ones who tend to take the most lead. Hmm. But we'll have to see. What is it that could make Slayer feel comfortable enough to finally, finally, finally let us know her story? I have to be able to keep going on these runs until we can get to that answer. She's part of our family now. Oh, hey! Weasel War Dance time! Huh. Would you look at that? That's hilarious! I never had the Weasel War Dance before. Where'd your buddy go? Uh, guess their distraction didn't work. You're far too food territorial to allow a weasel to steal something from you. Good job, Bodega. Bodega does not like sharing. Go ahead and chow down on that piece of meat. I'll pack up the weasel. Good job, Bodega. I appreciate you looking out for us. Good job, buddy. And then we ended up with more food than we that almost was a lost. Good diversion. And the pups ended up Smooth getting food. a little bit of uh, food on the run, Let's which is fantastic. All right, come on, pups. One more discovery, and then we're going to have to rest. I'm going to make us some nice food. We've got plenty of it at the moment, which is pretty awesome. Hmm. Let's go. And let's see which dog ends up picking the direction this time. Hmm. Hey, it's Chomps this time! Alright, Chomper. This next discovery is going to be on you, boy. I wonder what happens when we let them take the lead. It seems like good things. Oh, hey! I'm certain I read that owls are good omens. Uh, wait. Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, all good things come to those who wait. Sounds pretty good to me. What do you pups think? Noodle, what do you want to do? 
all it is. Let's go, Noodle. All right, Noodle Boy thinks this is. Oh, look at him! Oh, I oh, love good these omens. That's what we needed, team. What do we think it'll lead us to? So we've some birch. It's a good start. Nice. Mm, let's see. Let's see. I have birch, so let's watch the owl for a minute. I've never seen an owl this close before. So, what omen do you portend, huh? We can't go back. We haven't done anything yet. If I go back now, I'll have failed. Again. And Chopper is ready to run. He's hungry for competition, among other things. You're probably not gonna eat through the gang line and run off into the woods, are you, buddy? Right? Right? <laughs> Stop corn cop buying the gang line! Yes. I oh, love when we get that scene. the gang line near Chopper. Gross. But cool. Oh, is Gross that cool. Gift? There should be a special word for that. Let's go inspect the pellet. Last time we found bones, but apparently you can find other things inside of this pellet. Bones, bones, bones. Right. It's just full of bones. Teeny, There's someone's eating little bones. Here. I wish I could collect that. But all right. Apparently, sometimes you can find something else inside that pellet. So we're going to keep an eye here. out for that. Let's go. And Let's look for a good spot to camp. It's also time to stop for a snack. So good job, Chomps. You found us a good omen. And a great place to camp for dinner. This looks pretty good. Or I guess lunch. But all right, guys. Thank you so much for joining us on this journey. Once again, it's just totally unique. Every time we go out into the wild, we may see similar animals, but you just never know what's going to happen. If you guys could, do please leave a like for Slayer. I'm really hoping we'll be able to figure out her story. Fingers and paws crossed for that, I suppose. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!